What's up guys, Mizzo Frizzo from Pitchfork Academy here and welcome back for part 5 of my how to create a Steam multiplayer lobby system in Unreal Engine 5 tutorial series. In this part I'm going to be showing you how to set up a character selection menu. So as you can see here I've got this variety of characters and if I click this little icon down here it brings up my character selection menu. I can select a different character and you'll be able to see which character I've selected here. And I've got a couple of Steam friends to join me here. This is actually a packaged project that is running on the Steam subsystem. So I've got my Steam friends here. And if these guys select a different character, you can see which character they've selected right here in the lobby. And I'll even be showing you how to set it up so that the player info widget changes the height above the character depending on how tall the character is. So as you can see here, with these characters of various heights, the player info widget appears just over their head, no matter what height the character is. But just before we get started, guys, if you like what we do here at Pitchfork Academy and you'd like to connect with more like-minded people, access to our Discord server, Mizzo's Dizzo, is available for just $1.50 per month via Patreon. The Discord server is becoming a pretty cool place to be. There's heaps of cool, and very funny, and very helpful and smart people, as well as an integrated AI chatbot to help you with your Unreal Engine 5 related questions. Your $1.50 per month goes towards that AI chatbot. It's actually a paid model, so it's very clever indeed, as well as helping to support us and what we do here at Pitchfork Academy. But without further ado, let me show you how to do this.